In this video, we will go through the steps of how to register for Member Self Service, or MSS for short. First of all, you will need to go to the MSS section of our website here. You will then come to our homepage for MSS. If you have received an activation key from us, then you will need to register by clicking here. You will then be greeted by the login screen. If you have received an activation key, please complete your registration and click here. You will then need to add your surname, your NI number, your date of birth, including forward slashes, and lastly, your activation key, and then click continue. You will then be greeted by your dashboard on Member Self Service. If you wish to register for Member Self Service, but you do not have an activation key, please visit the Member Self Service section of our website, like before, but then go to the part where it says new user thinking of joining, click here to register. Then sign up here and then add your details as before. So your surname, your NI number, your date of birth, including forward slashes, and then input your email address that you wish us to contact you on. Lastly, click sign up. You will then automatically receive an email from us to say that you have successfully signed up to Member Self Service and then you need to click on the link below highlighted in blue to complete the registration process. By clicking on this link, this will bring you to the final registration screen. Please complete here your username, email address, confirm your email address and your new password. As you start inputting information here, you will see that it also pops up with some hints and tips of what information to input, such as what are acceptable passwords and so on. When you are finished and you're happy with the information you have inputted, then click on register at the bottom. You will then come to our login screen where you will need to add your username and the password you have just created. Answer your chosen question and then log in. Lastly, you will come to the consent page. So what this means is that you are agreeing with the information you have provided to us, such as your email address, that we hold that information and that we are able to contact you using those details that you have provided. We hope that you have found this video useful. Thank you for watching.